For MG fans, there is loads to see here at the NEC Classic Motor Show in 2022, including this area, which is basically the MG Car Club Village. There are loads of different MGs from all sorts of different eras of the mark as well. And we're starting here with the MG Car Club Young Members Branch, an MGB LE behind me, and also this, a very special guest of the Young Members Branch of the MG Car Club. This is Richard Hammond's car that he is preparing for racing, the smallest cog, is the uh, livery that it's wearing at the moment and this is an ongoing development that you can see on Richard Hammond's channel at the moment and he very very generously lent the MGB to the young members register of the MG car club for this show so great to see that bit of a celebrity car here and also a whole load of different MGs from different eras just like the rest of the MG car club here on the young members branch as well MGFs we've got a wonderful Z and we've got that lovely uh, sports car at the back there, the lovely uh, MGTF. And there they all are, the young members branch of the MG Car Club. Lovely display, Kieran, looking marvellous. And over here on the, uh, the main MG Car Club stand, there is some logos that sort of give a preview of what the MG Car Club is going to be getting up to in 2023. And the logos are over there on the back wall, of course, starting the centenary celebrations of the MG Mark and it's going to run their centenary right the way from June 2023 with a big event, the MG and Triumph 100 at Silverstone, right the way through to 2024. So a whole year of celebrations ahead for the MG community and the MG Car Club. This, of course, model MGB, this year in 2022, the MGB celebrated a monumental 60th anniversary and of course here is this MGB on the stand here at the NEC with its V8 engine in this particular one. But of course at the British Motor Museum in Gaydon uh, in September of 2022, there were thousands of MGB celebrating the 60th anniversary. So the celebrations continue with the MGB and moving round to the front of the MG Car Club's main stand here at the NEC Classic Motor Show. We'll start with another wonderful MGB GT here in blaze orange from 1973, so a little bit later on in the MGB story and again all part of those amazing 60th anniversary celebrations that the club has been enjoying throughout 2022. Not the only uh, anniversary that the MG Car Club has marked, there's been many others. One that sticks in my mind of course was the 90th anniversary of the MG J2 Midgets as well. And here we arrive at the 1950s, 1956 in fact, a ZA Magnet and this is a beautiful example of the sort of sports saloons that MG were producing during the 1950s, designed amazingly by the same man who designed Jowitz. Very, very good. I do love a magnet. One day I am going to have one of these. It's on the bucket list to own. And here is another beautiful example of a very early MG going right the way back to really the origins of the MG brand before they were built in Abingdon, built in Oxford, and this is a MG 1880 with a very special body on it, the Carlton Drophead Coupe. A real example of the era where Cecil Kimber was still very much at the helm of MG and very much starting to develop the MG brand into what it later became uh, after his death in 1945 in a train crash in Kings Cross Station, amazingly. So brilliant to see pre-war MGs represented here from the MG Car Club as well with that 1880. Moving on a little bit further is MG in the modern era and here an MG6 of course, still using the magnet name that came from that 1956 saloon that we saw just a moment ago. The MG6 celebrated 10 years in production uh, last year and still very much a favourite amongst those fans of the newer MGs, Chinese built of course. And here we have another example of a different era, the Longbridge era of MG with this wonderful MG ZS from 2005. But the action doesn't finish there because there's the main stand for the MG Car Club. Over here we have some of the other registers as well and here is the MGF register. Over a quarter of a century ago since the MGF was launched, can you believe? And of course morphing into the MGTF later on with the facelift versions. And they're always a friendly bunch. Give us a wave over there, the MG, there they are. After a tiring day, but the car's looking great here. So if you're an MGF owner, this is the place to be. These are the people you have to meet, and this is the club to join, of course. And if you want to find out more about the registers of the MG Car Club, go to mgcc.co.uk, click on the registers button there, and you can see a whole list 
of registers, the expertise in there for the various MG models. The last register along this, uh, this wall here to complete the MG Car Club Village here at the NEC Classic Motor Show. Of course, the MG Car Club Z register, celebrating those long bridge built cars from the early 2000s and relaunching this year their Save Our Zeds campaign. These cars are a really important and pivotal part of MG's history. And the MG Car Club very much of the opinion that we need to save our MG Zeds, we need to save and preserve these cars. It is a vital part of the MG story that needs protecting for the future. So the uh, Save Our Zeds campaign is part of the MG Car Club's efforts to keep these cars on the road. And that rounds up our tour of the MG Car Club Village here at the NEC Classic Motor Show for 2022.